The Center for Subsurface Energy and the Environment, or CSEE, is an organized research unit at the University of Texas at Austin that specializes in all aspects of subsurface energy uh, and the, in minimizing the environmental impact um, that it has. One of the ways we work with industry is these industrial affiliates programs. One of the IAPs is, is the Chemical Enhanced Oil Recovery IAP, which is designed to, to work on chemical flooding met methods for an enhancing oil recovery in reservoirs. We work on improving the oil recovery in um, harsh reservoirs, such as high temperature, high salinity carbonate reservoirs, fracture reservoirs, viscous oil reservoirs, and many others. In the recent years, we have come up with new uh, carboxylate type of surfactants that are compatible with high salinity. We have come up with surfactants that can change the wettability in carbonate reservoirs and we have improved the foam stability by including nanoparticles along with surfactants. We've been developing and testing new polymers, synthetic polymers um, that are useful at high temperature, high salinity reservoirs. We are doing things like adding um, bio size to improve the stability. We're testing new polymers that uh, are effective in low permeability reservoirs including below 10 millidarcies, uh, which really expands the use of what we can do with polymers. We do the experimental research to identify the basic physics that's happening uh, at, at the small scale, at the lab scale. But then to apply this research at the reservoir scale, which is much bigger, thousand times bigger, we need to take this physics and apply it at that scale. So that's why you have to develop theoretical models and put those models in computational models or reservoir simulations to see whether it is effective at the reservoir scale. We use uh, UTCHEM. Um, it's a reservoir simulator. It's the world's leading chemical flooding simulator. What's very unique about it is the, the research that we do here at UT Austin and, and, in, and in the IAP are inputs into the model. So as, as we have new discoveries, as we develop new models from those experiments, we input them into UT Chem, we test them, we validate them against other experiments and field data. And uh, what we've seen that industry will use UT Chem uh, to benchmark their simulators. Then they'll use the new science and the new models that are input into UT Chem to eventually add to their own simulators down the line. Our industrial partners have a very big role in shaping the research that we do. As we all know, the oil industry is, has big ups and downs, more than, far more than most. That makes it very difficult for the industry to sustain long-term research on enhanced oil recovery. First, they, of course, give us feedback. They suggest things that are important to them, that matter to them. They have problems that they've struggled with, longer-term problems, of course, and more fundamental problems that they want us to, to tackle. We continue to do the research with our graduate students year in and year out, decade in, decade out. So that, that is one of our biggest uh, benefits to the industry is this continuity.